there's this divine power, grace. It's as you're diligent in a covenant relationship, there's the second half of the covenant, that his spirit might be with us. Mm -hmm. And that spirit's like that sunlight that comes in. It's the Elder Christofferson called the, the Holy Ghost, the messenger of grace. And so now, as, as I'm diligently trying to live the gospel, that sunlight of grace comes and ignites and, and does something to the seed that I could never do. It does something to my nature that I could never do just by diligence. And it turns it into just something that is really Christ-like. It turns it into an attribute. As members of the church, we're very familiar with the statement in 2 Nephi that we are saved by grace after all we can do. Uh, and sometimes we get a bad rap for that. In the 1828 Webster's Dictionary, one of the archaic meanings for the word after is while in the process of or striving to do. So when we, when we quote that, we can say we are saved by grace while in the process of and striving to do mm -hmm. all that we can do. Jesus is walking with us the whole time. Mm -hmm.